Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, probably be expecting a bad mafia skit tomorrow, but um, otherwise we're um watching best of Trump supporters because I want to just fight or like debunk their logic. So yeah, let's watch it. Make America great again. I'm sorry that you happen to be black in a black neighborhood standing on. First off, can you get a shirt on? And why are... Uh, let's just continue with this. A corner where they endlessly find people with guns and drugs. I'm sorry. And the racial stereotypes enter the video. Okay. Okay. They should be shot if they're not... They're not being shot. They are, but at a, on a disproportionate rate. No. Three times. I don't believe that at all. When you look at when you look at it, he's married immigrant. I really want to listen to his logic more, because he honestly has none. And they, I mean, she has a good point. I mean, they are being shot at a very disper. Oh, I can't even say it, but yeah, she has a point. So three of them are immigrants. So what does that tell you? Is he racist? No. What would Sal look? Kind of. If he, he literally said, Mexico's gonna pay for the wall. They bring drugs and stuff to America, which they're just trying to escape violence. So I mean, yeah. I mean, he is a little bit of racist. Not even gonna lie. But okay. The whole thing in the border. If they would just start shooting, only shoot a couple, and they would go home. You think deterrence would work? They, if they would shoot. Shut down the dem- uh, shut down the gov- Okay. Wow. Well, that one's, uh, hard to take in, but... What logic does that have against anti-immigration? Like, holy crap, that- mm, no logic. Government, we need the money to put up that wall. We need a wall that is high as hell and as dangerous as hell to cross. People die crossing that wall, maybe they'll just stay on their side. I think if they were Republican voters. And more racism. Okay. Yeah, um, I really just want to say there is no logic to their thinking most of the time. They'd be stopped. <laughs> Uh, the the Latinas at the border. Yeah, we visited we'll sanctuary in si in. cities in port up in Portland this summer. It was disgusting, and it's. Let me just point out that Karen haircut. That's when you know she's a Trump supporter. Sanctuary and Chicago we sanctuary have to be cities, and we're familiar with that. We don't want that in our country. He speaks his mind. He says what's on his mind, and we're in his best interest when he does. Didn't he, like, say he did try to rape people? Yeah, I think he did. I'm a mother of a child that's a little boy. What if 10 years from now when he's older, a girl claims that he raped her with no evidence? As a mother, do I just accept that? Well, what if you had a little girl who no one believed? Well, I'm also a survivor of abortion. My mother tried to self-abort me, so I feel... Well, I'm just going to be straight up honest. Really don't blame her. Just saying. Like that if I were a mother of a little girl, I wouldn't have let a 15 year old go to a party and get drunk. I've said it for a long time. Women should button their blouse, cross their legs, and quit acting like they want something. And then they won't get it. What? Okay, I've been watching a ton of these and they're like, oh yeah, women can't be president and stuff. It's like, don't you want? Uh, like, be somewhere in life, or I, I just don't know. Oh, wow, so you're saying it's more on the women. I think it's ridiculous. They're not traumatized. They, no, I mean, 30 years ago, be real, okay? Let's be real. So you're talking about Kavanaugh there? Whoever, whoever. You don't wait 30 years and then say someone assaulted you. Just don't do it. If anything, uh, she should have did like Monica. Yeah, I mean, kind of do. Winsky and saved the dress. Oh, he did fondled me. Real 35 years ago, this is a Democrat playbook, and everybody in America knows it. Everybody's great, happy when they get the Oscar, 
And then whenever, I mean, I'm not saying he's not a scum bucket. Harvey Weinstein? Yeah. But they knew what they were doing. So on your back. I am losing brain cells just watching this. Oh, my God. Back you got George Soros, Hillary Clinton, Obama, and the Ayatollah. As negative, not positive. As Trump supporters have use swastikas as part of their flag and stuff. Like, okay. Right. You can see Michael the Archangel casting the demon into the abyss, and then you have below them the enemies of the United States and its constitution. So can you explain why uh, Soros, Obama, Clinton, and the Ayatollah are the enemies of the state? Oh, come on, you know that. Oh, another Karen. Mm -hmm. uh, if you don't know that, you shouldn't be at a Trump rally. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, that was certainly hard to watch. Um, okay. Well, anyway, guys, see you.